We'll run it with the free kick. There's three minutes gone, and Chelsea have only formed a two-man walk. Oh, Neil Ruddock puts West Ham in the lead, and really, I don't know what the organisation was doing there. No wonder he looked so happy. But Chelsea really do need to sort themselves out in defence on those set plays. Zola. With the cross. Kazaragi. Oh, what a collision. That was Hislop and Ferdinand going in. And Kazaragi's injured. He's down and in some trouble. He's calling for Mike Banks to come on quickly. The referees stopped it. And Mike Banks steaming on. And Kazaragi went in there with Hislop and Ferdinand. And his knee just got caught underneath the goalkeeper. Deep concern. There's no stretcher. Where's the stretcher? Zola's free kick. And there's still no stretcher coming in. Pierce just got a foot on it as well, but that really was a very bad looking injury. And Torre Andre Flo will take Kazaragi's place. And we've just got to hope that that injury isn't as bad as it looks. Well, it's been all Chelsea pressure, 15 minutes left. Wise with the corner. Nichols, that's the bar. Who'll put it in? Anyone? Babiaro, yes! Babiaro equalises, that's his second goal of the season. And look at Payet calling for the double somersault. Come on, Bubba. Yes! One all then, and Chelsea really have changed things around since half-time. Flo's been penetrating, and Petrescu came on with Poyet moving into the middle. Di Matteo wasn't having such a good game, and Chelsea with players in the box. And Babiaro, the most crucial. One off. 